an example of abstraction in object-oriented programming. If you just watched my video on encapsulation versus abstraction, you may have gotten the high-level definition, but I thought I should provide some examples of each. Abstraction is really about only presenting the necessary amounts of information to the user. Now, some people get this backwards, but encapsulation is that everything is contained within the code, and abstraction is about things happen and you don't care how they get done or can't be told how they get done. For example, if you had software that was going to ship a package when an order came in, it would have to use abstraction to ship that package. You can't have software deliver the package. All you can tell, do is tell FedEx, deliver this package to Denver and let me know when it gets there with a confirmation number. So. Through the abstraction layer, you're saying, ship this thing, and three days later when you get the confirmation, you update the database that says, ta-da, it came in. And that's abstracted. You can't encapsulate it in the software because there's real world stuff that's happening. And through abstraction, you could call this API that says, ship this thing, and here's the date that it needs to be there by. And the FedEx layer, would say, okay, this package is needs to be there by the 4th of June, therefore we're going to ship it by ground or by rail or by airplane. And you don't care how the answer was derived. You have no insight into how the air how it was derived quite possibly. You simply said, do this and expected it would get done. And unless you're told otherwise, assume that it that it happened. And that's what abstraction is really about, especially with like the hardware abstraction layer where your software is saying, store all these variables, store all these variables, do these things, do these things. And when the memory starts to get low, you say, hey, let's do some garbage collection. Let's throw away some of this stuff we don't need. Or you told me to write to the hard drive, but I haven't done it yet. I just told you I did okay, I'm going to do a whole bunch of writes to the hard drive. That's all abstracted from you. You don't need to know about it. You don't need to care how it gets done. It may not even be done the same way on every computer. It's abstracted. And that is the difference between encapsulation and abstraction is that encapsulated, everything is happening there in the capsule. And abstraction, you just, you only get the data that you kind of need to know about or that can be given to you. And what is happening could change wildly between installs, locations, whatever. And that's, you know, beyond your control.